Hello, gentlemen. Patrick Ryan here, founder of Wingman for You. We help men find the women of their dreams by teaching them how to approach women with confidence. Now, gentlemen, this is a serious video because this is about loneliness and isolation. Now, I'm making this video in early 2023, but if we go back just three years ago when the pandemic first started and the orders were to shelter in, I got to tell you, it drove me crazy. I thought I was a caged animal. I felt like I was pacing back and forth in my home, back and forth, because I'm one of those people, people, people. I am so gregarious. I need people to find energy. And guess what? If our energy drops because of this, because of isolation, guess what increases? Loneliness and that feeling of being trapped. And that's how I felt. I got to tell you, that's exactly how I felt three years ago today. So guys, I want to let you know, there are some big health issues with loneliness and isolation. One is your cortisol levels can skyrocket. Those are the depressing hormones. In addition to that, our bodies can get inflamed. We can oftentimes drink too much and not eat properly. And then lastly, when we're depressed, when we're alone, when we're lonely, when we feel isolated, we oftentimes do little to no exercise. And those things there can lead to further depression. And in fact, in some cases, heart attack or stroke. So guys, this is a very serious topic. I wanna to talk to you about how we can get out of isolation. Well, one of the first things, even if you're an introvert, as introverted as you are, you may be home alone and have lots of energy, but you may not realize that you're either suffering from depression or some sort of state of loneliness. And it's a human desire to connect with people. So we need to get out and connect. So whether you're going out with a couple of friends or even by yourself, go ahead, get out there and actually start talking to people. Get some conversations going. You'll feel better. You'll have more energy. You'll start exercising again. You'll lay off the booze you'll start eating better, your cortisol levels will go down and the inflammation in your body will slowly disappear. So guys, my suggestion is get out and talk to people, get away from work. If you're home working, doing the remote thing, get out, get out for lunch, run out at dinner, go to a exercise studio, go to join a gym and get involved with other people. It's one of the only things we can do as humans to get out of this loneliness, this isolation that we've been experiencing the last three years. Guys, I really hope that this has helped you get a little bit more enthusiasm about your life and about perhaps finding the woman of your dreams. So guys, again, hit that, hit that subscribe button so that you don't miss any of my videos. And I'll see you in the next video.